for many communities, fall is an important time of year for business. The changing leaves can bring in thousands of tourists from all over to take in their beauty. But the typical arrival of fall colors this year has been delayed in many parts of Minnesota and Wisconsin. WCCO's Alan Henry spoke with forestry and weather experts to find out why. It's actually kind of surprising, you know, you wouldn't expect it to be as slow as it's been. Paul Maddox took his camera out and went searching for fall colors near Lake Harriet this morning, an annual tradition. I would expect it to be a little bit more orangey, you know, because like around this time last year, I was actually out around this area. I was getting some really nice pictures of fall colors. Both the Department of Natural Resources and the National Weather Service say there are several reasons for the delay in fall colors, one of them being a warmer than usual September. So for the month of September here in the Twin Cities, we pen 3.3 degrees above normal. We just really need a lot of cold nights. I mean, really cold into the 30s for a sustained period of time before the red colors pop. This map shows how during the last week of September, the fall colors have slowly disappeared. Experts say another reason for it this year is the drought, which is likely to break a record this week. If we don't get any more rain here in the Twin Cities over the next uh, four days, we're going to be the driest September on record in the Twin Cities. And that those records go back to 1871. And because the colors depend on the weather, experts say it'll happen when it happens. The weather is what it is, and so we can't change that. We just have to keep our fingers crossed for those bright sunny days with that cold, crisp evening. Alan Henry, WCCO 4 News. That delay in colors means you still have time to plan a trip to see them. Today on The Four, we got some tips on where to find some of the best colors in the state. Chuck Olson is a nature photographer who lives in Tofty, and these are some of his favorite fall snapshots taken along the North Shore where he now calls home. He told us that there is still time to plan a trip north to see those fall colors and then shared some of his favorite spots. Caribou Trail is beautiful right now. Ski Hill Road towards the Lutzen Mountain Ski Resort is a great place, um, even just from your car, uh, to hop out. Um, if you actually want to get some fresh air and have a nice hike, uh, one of my favorite spots is called Oberg Mountain, and that's in Tofty. Typically, the fall colors in Minnesota will be past peak by mid-October, but with this year's delay, odds are you might get an extra week or so.